Nvidia is getting closer to becoming the world's largest company. Currently, Apple is the largest company with a market cap of $3.37 trillion. However, Nvidia is not far behind, holding the second position with a valuation of $3.13 trillion. For Nvidia to surpass Apple as the largest company, its stock would need to increase by approximately 8%, while Apple's stock remains stable. But is this realistic? Consider that Apple's revenue in the past 12 months was $385 billion, whereas Nvidia's was significantly lower, at $96 billion. Before we begin, this video is not an investment advice and must do your own diligence. However, with my experience investing for years, the content from this video has a solid research foundation. Check our Patreon on the description below for an inside members-only access on what are the best buys now. We will also update you on what to sell for gains or to avoid losses. Subscribe to our channel so you will never miss out. Apple has a growth problem, while Nvidia doesn't. Apple's consumer products are widely popular both in the United States and internationally. However, it has faced challenges in translating this popularity into significant revenue growth lately, as its most well-known product, the iPhone, has not shown meaningful sales growth in the past three years. There was high anticipation that the release of this year's iPhone 16 would spark a wave of upgrades, largely due to its ability to operate Apple's version of artificial intelligence, called Apple Intelligence. Unfortunately for Apple, many reports indicate that demand for the iPhone 16 has not been as strong as expected, affecting its potential as a major business driver. Nvidia, on the other hand, does not have this issue. Its graphics processing units, or GPUs, are at the forefront of the AI revolution, thanks to being top tier. The largest AI companies are purchasing these GPUs in the thousands, which has been a huge advantage for Nvidia. In the second quarter of fiscal year 2025, which ended on July 28th, Nvidia's revenue surged by 122% compared to the same period last year. This momentum is expected to continue into the next quarter, with company leadership projecting revenue of $32.5 billion, reflecting approximately 80% growth year over year. Nvidia is expected to see revenue growth at least through the next year, as many companies continue to develop their AI computing infrastructure. To further boost NVIDIA's growth potential, the company is launching its Blackwell architecture. This new architecture will provide significant speed improvements compared to its current Hopper architecture. Wall Street analysts predict that NVIDIA's revenue will increase by approximately 42% next year, significantly outpacing Apple's projected growth of 8%. However, even with that growth, NVIDIA will still not match Apple's total revenue. So. How can a company with much lower revenue potentially surpass another as the largest company in the world? Nvidia's profits are set to explode next year. When evaluating a company, revenue isn't the only factor to consider. Profits and valuation hold greater importance. For example, if revenue was the sole metric, then Walmart would be valued as the largest company in the world. Walmart generated $665 billion in revenue last year, compared to Apple's $385 billion. However, when you factor in profits, Nvidia starts to catch up with Apple. While Nvidia is closing the gap quickly, it still produces about half the profits that Apple does. But with Nvidia's rapid growth rate and a much stronger profit margin, 55% compared to Apple's 26%, Nvidia could soon reach Apple's profit levels. By the end of each company's next fiscal year, Apple's ends around September and Nvidia's ends in January. If both maintain their current profit margins, Apple is projected to generate around $110 billion in profits, while Nvidia could come in just below at $98 billion. That's an enormous gap to close in just a year. But if Nvidia continues to grow as analysts expect, it will be right there alongside Apple. Now let's talk about valuation. Investors typically assign higher valuations to companies growing at a faster pace or those with a strong brand. Nvidia has both, a fast growth rate and a solid brand, which explains its high valuation. Apple, on the other hand, has a very strong brand but slower growth. If Nvidia continues its revenue growth through 2026, it may command a higher valuation premium than Apple, 
potentially allowing it to surpass Apple as the world's largest company. NVIDIA has a lot of momentum, and its financial situation is expected to change dramatically over the next year. This might just be enough for NVIDIA to surpass Apple, especially as Apple deals with some growth challenges. Give us a like if you like our video, subscribe and ring the bell to never miss out. Check our patron for an inside look on what are the best buy and sell stocks every week.